Hello friends, welcome to Cooking with Claudia. Today we're making these delicious honey garlic wings. These chicken wings are packed with delicious flavors. They're so, so good. Let's get started. I have some chicken wings in a mixing bowl. Make sure your chicken wings are dry. There shouldn't be any water on them. We want these to come out nice and crispy. Okay guys? We're going to start by drizzling some olive oil all over the wings, then toss them together to coat. Next, we're going to season the wings with some salt, black pepper, paprika, garlic powder, and onion powder. Mix the spices together very well, then add to the chicken. Go ahead and mix the spices and chicken together. Make sure you mix in very well. We want every single piece of chicken to be very well coated in the spices, okay guys? Next, you're going to grab a large baking pan. I lined my baking pan with aluminum foil to make cleanup easy, and I also sprayed it with nonstick spray, that way the chicken don't stick. Make sure you space out the wings, that way they can crisp up very well. Don't overcrowd the pan. You can use two baking pans, or you can just use one large baking pan. Your oven should be preheated to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. Place the wings into the oven and let them bake for 20 minutes. After the wings have baked for 20 minutes, you're going to take them out then flip them. After flipping them all over, place them back into the oven to bake for 10 minutes. While the wings are baking, we're going to put together the honey garlic sauce. Into an empty bowl, I'm adding some chicken broth, honey, soy sauce, rice vinegar, sesame oil, freshly minced garlic, freshly minced ginger, red pepper flakes, and last we're adding cornstarch. Mix everything together very well. Once mixed in, you're going to pour the sauce into a pan over medium heat. You're going to let the sauce cook until it comes to a simmer. Then you're going to reduce the heat to medium low and let the sauce simmer gently for 10 minutes to thicken. After the honey garlic sauce has finished cooking, you're going to take out your wings, then brush them with the sauce. Keep in mind that at this time, the wings have already baked for 30 minutes. Once you've brushed all the wings with the sauce, you're going to turn them over, then brush the other side as well. Once you've brushed both sides of the wings, you're going to place them back into the oven to bake for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, you're going to take out the wings, then brush only the top part with the remaining sauce. Then you're going to place them back into the oven to bake for another 5 minutes. So in total, we're baking the wings for 40 minutes. After the wings have finished baking, they look good as they are. This part is optional, but I like to put them back into the oven, press broil on my oven, and let them broil for a minute or two. This will make the sauce extra sticky. If you choose to broil your wings, keep a close eye on them so they don't burn or dry out, okay guys? Do you guys see how sticky the sauce is? These wings are going to make your house smell so good. These wings will pair really well with some seasoned fries. I like to enjoy them with sweet potato fries as well. They also will make a great appetizer for the holidays. The wings came out packed with so much flavor. They're very crispy on the outside and succulent on the inside. The honey garlic sauce is so good on the wings. It's just so sticky and delicious. If you guys would like to make these delicious honey garlic wings, check the description box for all the ingredients and measurements.